Okay, awesome. So, hey guys, we're so excited to share about Young Living and Natural Living with our plant-based products, as well as affordable ways to ditch the chemicals and switch to nature. So, I am Rebecca Nairn, and we also have Annalie, Haley, and Ashley on here. Say hi, ladies. Hi. <laughs> Hello. So, I have been using Young Living products for probably about seven years. I've always used the oils and the household cleaner and just recently started to really get interested in learning about the how and the why behind the different oils and the company. So because I have five-year-old daughters and they are very much into helping me clean and putting on my lip gloss and wearing perfume and all the things. So I don't want them putting chemicals in their body. Bo bottoms <laughs> in their bodies and <laughs> breathing in um, chemicals and toxins so I am switching everything to toxin free chemical free and young living makes that 100% easy and doable for us so um, we're just going to talk a little bit about toxins and chemicals and why we have chosen young living so the average woman applies 130 unique toxic chemicals before breakfast. That is so scary. On your face lotions and your toothpaste, hand soap, shampoo, and makeup. You might be completely oblivious to the fact that the products we use on ourselves and in our home and on our kids in our everyday lives could be the very things that are contributing to why we're sick, why we have health problems, why we struggle emotionally, and why we are just surviving and not thriving. I know that I have um, a few friends who are my age, which like 33, 32, who have recently gotten cancer. And that is super, super scary to me. So I'm trying to do everything I can to prevent chemicals and toxins from being in my life. Not saying that that's going to prevent cancer, but it certainly can help. And that's something that I can do for my family. Um, so there's lots and lots of different chemicals and toxins that we can talk about. There's sodium, lauryl sulfate. Sorry if I'm saying it wrong. Um, this is in store-bought soaps. They contain sodium lard sulfate. It's a top toxic chemical used to remove car grease off of garage floors. That could probably be really damaging to your skin as well as disruptive to your immune health and hormonal health. Um, there's also phthalates and both adult and chemical shampoos contain phthalates. Am I saying that right, Ashley? <laughs> phthalates. Um, it's a toxic chemical that has been banned in children's toys but it's still found in body cleansing products. That's terrifying to me. It is known to be an endocrine disruptor and very hard for the body to break down when used consistently during bath time. Formaldehyde, it's the main ingredient in candles and home, home sprays. Formaldehyde is the number one cancer causing chemical and it's what we get embalmed with at the morgue. They say inhaling scents from candles or sprays is equivalent to inhaling, inhaling secondhand smoke which is even more dangerous than actual smoking the cigarette itself. I know um, as a per personal testimony for me, when I smell any kind of synthetic smells like candles or uh, room sprays, I immediately get a headache and my lips and my tongue start tingling. My husband thinks I'm crazy. I'll get in his car. He's got those little Christmas tree um, car scent things. And as soon as I get in the car, my head starts hurting and I start tingling. So a lot of people don't have that sensitivity, so they don't know what the chemicals and toxins are doing to their body, um, but I can 100% testify to it. Um, so then there's something called butoxinol, and I'm sure I'm saying that one wrong too, but it's, a, it's in store-bought household cleaning products. Um, they contain this chemical, and it's a toxin knows, known to cause sore throats, narcosis and severe liver and kidney damage which is just all of these facts are terrifying to me then we have benzyl alcohol it's a, it's in store-bought laundry detergents and dryer sheets they contain this toxin it's um they are toxic ingredients that cause central nervous system disorders lots uh, loss of muscular coordination central nervous system depression headaches nausea and vomiting I am using some notes here, so that's what it is. Now, fragrance is like one of the most, 
like common ones that I am finding. It's in many, many baby products contain the listed ingredient fragrance, which is simply a broad category that hides hundreds of toxic chemicals behind that word itself. Companies aren't required to reveal the actual chemicals that are in the fragrance category, hence keeping the public in the dark about the true toxicity of the products we use in our little ones. Uh, there are lots and lots of natural, like all natural products that people use that I used to even use, like Miss Myers and Method, and people think they're like all natural and healthy and great for us to use, but they have fragrances. And I was even use them, using them at one point and when I would, I would get the headache and my hands actually, when I touch them, my hands um, like cringe up, which is just another reaction I have to synthetic chemicals. People think I'm crazy, but I'm not making it up. It's like completely true. Next, we have triclosan and perk. They are found in antibacterial hand soaps and sanitizers and even toothpaste. They were recently banned from the shelves in the USA, driven by the medical community, due to concerns over growing incidents of antibiotic resistant superbugs. Um, I know those are popping up all over the place these days and that's so scary. These chemicals are basically topical antibiotics which when applied to the skin, they enter the bloodstream stream and they kill the good and bad bacteria in the skin and in the gut. This weakens our immune system and leads to antibiotic resistance. It also causes cancer, endocrine disruption, and birth defects. When we put these products on ourselves and our children on a daily basis, the toxins build up and they accumulate in our bodies. It's a process called bioaccumulation. This means that we, the more we expose ourselves to these toxins, the harder it is for our bodies to break them down. And because of this buildup, it causes both major and minor health issues that otherwise could be prevented if we simply quit using those toxins. So even if these issues aren't apparent right now, they will be apparent later on down the road. So what's even scarier to know is that some of the most popular organic products can still contain the ingredients above. Like that's what I just mentioned about um, the cleaners that I've used, the soaps, even like uh, her, even like makeup and face cleaners and hair conditioner. Even if you think you're making a better decision about going organic instead of conventional, there's still a probability that your organic product is highly toxic for yourself and your kids. So I want you to write this down. Go back and look it up yourself. Visit the Environmental Working Group website, website and it's ewg.org. So plug in the ingredients of your products and see how high it is rated in toxicity. Or you can also download the Think Dirty app. I have that on my, on my phone and look at the toxicity levels. People probably think I'm crazy when I have like my phone out scanning products in, this, in Target, but it's really scary to do that. And then like all these products that you think are like so good for us to use because they're well-known brands created by like movie stars um, that we trust, they're actually really not, they're really not great for us. They have nice names, they say organic, but they're not good for us or our kids, which is even more important to me. Um, so the results will shock you, and you'll probably want to immediately throw some of those products in the trash. Uh, that's what I did. I bought them at Target, and then I was like, oh my gosh, like, can't use these. I didn't tell my husband I did that, um, but I did. So now that we've effectively freaked you out, let us begin by saying that there is absolutely no judgment here. We've all been there. I've used the product on ourselves um, all the time and on our kids. But once we educated ourselves on the toxicity of what we're using in our home, and once we ditched and switched over to plant-based products, our lives have been changed forever, and our families have and are experiencing the perfect wellness that God has always wanted and intended for us to have. And because we've seen such amazing changes, we really wanted to educate our friends and loved ones and everybody on the invisible toxins in your home too. So you're welcome, <laughs> um, but no fear, because there is a better way. You don't need to use these synthetic chemicals to clean your home. You don't need synthetic chemicals to make yourself beautiful. Um, I know when I first started talking Young Living with Haley, who is like my skincare go-to, like she knows literally everything about skincare. I'm like, what do I need for this? 
she would, she'll tell me everything. And she's like, okay, I'll use the oils. I'll use the supplements, but don't think I'm changing all my face, my face products over. Well, she has been. <laughs> so I love it. I'm like, what are you using now? And she'll tell me which young living products she's using. And I just love that. She is like a testimony to the skincare portion and everything else, but that's kind of her specialty. So anything you put in your skin should be safe to ingest because our skin is one of our largest organs and anything applied to the skin gets absorbed quickly into our bodies. Anything you breathe in should also be safe to ingest. So that comes to the question of why essential oils? I believe that every mom, lady, dad, everyone has the unique ability to heal herself and her family. This is health freedom. The freedom to be empowered with the ability to learn how to keep your family safe from harm due to synthetic chemical exposure. I believe in the ability to help our family thrive and not just survive. We want to educate other, others about the dangers of toxic synthetic chemicals just like we are here right now. So no child or adult should have to suffer from health issues due, something, due to something that's completely preventable like environmental toxins and allergens. I believe that we should be able to meet our health needs naturally without negative side effects. Um, we should 100% be able to address the issue versus the symptoms. So patent law says that you can't patent nature. For some time before patents came into play, plants were medicine. Then once you could patent something as your own, the, the draw to synthesize and make nature in a lab and modify it a bit, a bit became really strong. While there's always a place for Western medicine in a health crisis, I 100% believe that. My sister has been through cancer. She's had chemotherapy. It saved her life. Um, there is so much wisdom in what is old that is now new again. So we're, it is worthwhile to relearn what we've lost and know that we can handle ourselves, our babies, our kids, and husbands on a day-to-day -day, day -day basis. That's super empowering. One of my friends, um, we were chatting about oils, and she says, I feel like I'm going back to, like, my grandparents' time. Um, and I'm like, yeah, basically, we kind of are. And I think that's really awesome because back then in our grandparents' time, there probably weren't as many synthetic chemicals and toxins so readily available to us. So, you know, like, more power to us for being able to go back to um, the more natural way of living when we need to. So that's the kind of intro. And now we're going to talk about the science of all of this. So if you don't like science, then just you can turn your ears off for a minute. But mm -hmm. I really love this part because it kind of tells you like why you need essential oils other than, oh, they smell really good and the diffuser is really pretty. This is going to tell you the why behind the oils and kind of like um, why it's really important to make this investment. So bring it on, ladies. Let's talk about the science. Cool. I will talk to you about the science. Um, so as you know, as uh, Becca just mentioned, um, everything that shouldn't go in your mouth should also not go in your skin. Um, our, our skin is really absorbent. So essential oils penetrate our skin really fast and they move into the bloodstream um, and they enter our cells. So each cell um, has receptors on the outside um, that allow toxins to filter out. And they keep the good things like the antioxidants, they allow them to come in and they take out the bad guys. So when they become clogged, it's really difficult um, for for that relationship to happen so things that are um petroleum based like lotions and makeup those are things that clog these cells and um, don't allow that communication to happen so um, essential oils are really awesome because they can come and act as little scrubbing brushes and they can clean up those cell membranes and help that that communication to to move swiftly um, so it increases cellular commun communication, like a good marriage, right? Like a good relationship. So um, what are essential oils? So um, as Becca mentioned earlier, um, nature has provided us with everything to survive and thrive on this earth. Um, the plants used for essential oils have been around longer than we have. Um, and yeah, humans have been using nature's abundance in many ways, from the obvious uses like food 
and shelter um, to the lesser known things like distillation of essential oils. Um, so it's just truly a gift that we've been given to be able to naturally just support our health through these um, plants. So essential oils are highly concentrated. Um, they're aromatic essences of trees, shrubs, herbs, grasses, resins, flowers. Um, they're greaseless, so they're not like the other oils you have in your home, like olive oil or coconut oil. Um, they're um, a plant's natural defense and protective mechanism. So they work the same in our bodies as they do in nature. So they penetrate our cell membranes, they disperse into our blood and our tissues. Um, one drop has got countless molecules that affects the entire body at the cellular level. Um, sure, they, their purpose is to smell amazing. That is true. Um, but they also do so much more. They support our, um, all of our body systems by keeping our bodies clean and our system functioning as it should. Um, obviously, you know, we have our livers to do all this great work and whatever, but my goodness, give them a break. <laughs> Let the oils help us a little. <laughs> We're really bombarding them with um, with everything going on in the world. Whether you're walking outside and inhaling a, uh, the fume from a car, or just you know walking into a store and they've sprayed it with something. Goodness, our poor bodies need some help. <laughs> so the key to producing these um, therapeutic grade essential oils um, is. Oh, sorry, I think we lost Becca there. Um, is to preserve as many of the delicate compounds as possible because um, even the smallest compounds play um, a really important role in arriving at the final result. It's kind of like a symphony. The quality of the music is dependent on each individual instrument coming together. Um, so if one instrument is off key, goodness, it's not gonna sound that great, is it? So yeah, it's really important um, to keep it pure though. So to be clear, all oils are not created equally. Um, thankfully, Young Living is the oldest, most trusted and well-respected essential oil company in the world. Um, we're the leader, um, the world leader, and now a billion dollar company with over two million active members. Actually, I think that's three million now, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's three million now. Um, and, and countless countries around the globe and adding more all the time. Um, They've got over 25 years of research and experience and it's the only essential oil company um, to own their own farms and they offer their seed to seal guarantee. Seriously, they test like the soil, the air quality, the water source, everything. And they're tested in every single one of those stages. Um, it's really, it's amazing. Their transparency is amazing. It's really great. Um, so yeah, it's great to be able to know the farmer. They actually invite um, members of Young Living to come to the farms and take part in it, um, in the whole process as well. So from, yeah, from the time that the, the seed is sourced until the oil is sealed in the bottle, they're constantly, rigorously doing quality controls um, to make sure that everything is just amazing. <laughs> Um, yeah, so Young Living Farms are completely open about their farming practices and it's beyond organic, um, it's sustainable and it's beneficial to the environment around them and, and to the people that they employ and that they're surrounded by. Um, yeah, so they use no pesticides. As I said, they are organic. So there's no pesticides, no harsh chemicals used on the farms. Um, they have crew that hand pick the weeds um, so they, yeah, I mean, I think they also use some of their essential oils to help as natural, um, pesticides, but they don't use any outside pesticides, anything. They don't use any harsh chemicals. Um, so there's no other essential oils company that is quite as committed to quality as Young Living is. So they also make lead, leading edge essential oils enhanced supplements. So the supplements have the oils in them as well. They also have food products, um, non-toxic um, personal care products, household cleaning products and makeup. They also have items for your furry friends. Um, and yeah, so they're all unsurpassed in their quality and effectiveness and you can't find it anywhere else in the market. Um, they're really leading the way in restoring health and wellness to our families 
and our communities. Honestly, their um, Thieves line of products is really good. I've personally been using their um, Thieves Cleaner. It's crazy. Like <laughs> you need like one little capful for a giant bottle. And um, I felt really comfortable giving my daughter the chore of um, cleaning the windows because just standing like this up to the window, spraying on it and wiping it. I just thought, imagine if that wasn't thieves. I mean, that would just be so dangerous and just so terrible for her to inhale. So I've been loving it. And I mopped my entire house with it. It's so, so good. So good. <laughs> so basically, you're ditching the products that you're already using and just replacing it with something else from Young Living, like I did with the cleaning products. Um, so yeah, it's a one-stop shop for all the things you need for yourself and for your home and your family and your children and your health and your pets. <laughs> so yeah, the only thing that's inside the essential oil bottle is the plant itself. There's, there aren't any additives or fillers or synthetic fragrances or preservatives or dyes or any of those ingredients that Becca mentioned earlier. Um, and the same goes for all their products. Um, the only ingredients in the products are the ones listed on the label and they're all plant-based. Not one single ingredient is synthetic or toxic or chemically derived. Um, it's, it's quite scary though, because if you look at most of the, um, the essential oils that you would buy just at the store, um, up to 95% of it is allowed to be something else. Um, and that scares me because they don't have to list those things, but they can still label it as 100% um, pure essential oils. And it could be um, artificial ingredients in it. It could be just a carrier oil. It could be fragrance, artificial fragrance, um, which, as we heard earlier, it's just horrible. <laughs> so, yeah. So, yeah, you can go to ewg.org, as Becca said. You can look at the, the app. Um, you can take a look at all those ingredients as well. Um, so yeah, now we're going to learn about how to use the oils and we are going to have our lovely Miss Haley telling us all about how to use the oils. Over to you, Haley. Oh, hi everybody. Um, I'm Haley. I'm originally from South Africa, uh, living in America now and very excited to be part of this company. Um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about how to use the essential oils. Uh, there's three different ways, topically, aromatically, internally as a dietary supplement. Um, so topically, also known as a transdermal, essential oils are rapidly absorbed by the skin, which is not uh, surprising considering the skin is the largest organ of the body. Um, applying the oils to your feet um, is a good way for the oils to be absorbed into your body. We have over 2,000 pores. Um, in our feet, uh, it's, and they're the largest pores in our body. So um, I love to rub my oils on my feet before I go to bed at night, um, especially lavender. Um, you can also uh, bathe in the oils. Um, it's best to mix about 15 to 20 drops with Epsom salts in a separate bowl and then pour the bowl into your bath. Um, inhalation. What memory does the smell of uh, freshly baked cookies evoke in you or a hot cup of cider um, or freshly cut grass? Uh, scents are very powerful and uh, the best way to reach the mood center is through our noses. Um, in less than a second, essential oils hit the limbic system and um, have the power to affect our moods. Um, 70 5% of Americans um, use synthetic air fresheners. And I have to say, I was one of them. Mm -hmm. I used to spray my house with Febreze all the time. <laughs> but I don't do that anymore. <laughs> um, yep, Which so they contain... Do you do better? I, I know better now. Yep, <laughs> I know better. Um, they contain numerous amounts of chemical agents that are linked to cancer, as we've spoken about before. Um, namely um, formaldehyde. Um, when you see this term, it's named as fragrance. Uh, it's the number one cancer-causing um, toxin. And when you see the word fragrance, um, it could include up to 300 different toxic chemicals. Um, formaldehyde is the number one cancer-causing chemical. 
and it's what you're embalmed in when you go to the morgue. Uh, we are breathing this in when um, you really don't have to. Uh, tenting is another one. We pour boiling hot water into a glass bowl. I remember doing this as a little girl with my mom when I'm all stuffed up. Um, put about two to three drops of essential oils of your choice uh, and breathe in the vapors while covering your head with a towel. Um, excellent for your respiratory um, system and uh, emotional support. And ingesting is another one. You can also get benefits from ingesting these Young Living Essential Oils. You put them in a veggie capsule um, and you take them as a pill. Uh, because they are 100% pure with no synthetics, using the best strain of the plant material, um, you just, uh, where am I? The Young Living Essential Oils. Yeah, other ways to ingest, um, you can just add to your water. I love to add lemon. Um, orange, lime, um, they're all wonderful. Peppermint, uh, you can cook with the oils, add them to your food, refer to the, the bottle label and product guide um, to know if any of the essential oils is uh, safe to take as a dietary supplement. Um, so now we can talk about um, safety. Uh, you can put these oils in every orifice in your body except for two places. And they aren't the places you might be thinking of. You shouldn't put the oils in your eyes and your ears. Um, care should be taken to dilute the oils that are hot to the skin. Um, if, if an oil ever feels hot, do not try to wash it off. You should use a carrier oil, so like a coconut oil or almond oil. Um, to the affected area and it will stop that um, excited feeling. What is a carrier oil? A carrier oil is a fatty oil such as coconut or avocado oil like we've mentioned. Uh, look for cold press and organic in your health food section. Young Living does have one. They call it the uh, V6 oil. Um, we use carrier oils to dilute our essential oils and make them easier to spread over a large um, part of your body. Um, I do that with the pan away um, for my back. Um, it's great for after a workout. Um, diluting the oils um, with a carry oil doesn't mean that you're going to lose its effectiveness. Um, it just means you can spread it over a larger area. Um, so who here is thinking which oils do I start with? Um, well, you're going to meet your, the starter kit. It's all the most popular oils that Young Living um, sell. Your basics in your kitchen um, that you use every day, like salt, pepper, and butter. They are the most common basic ingredients you likely reach for most in your kitchen. Um, it's the same with essential oils. So the oils I'm about to go through, we've yeah, I've got 10 different oils. Um, uh, way to get you started to empower to get rid of um, the toxins the toxic products in your home um, you can make some beauty and cleaning products from them as well and your body systems are supported um, optimally so what's in the kit um, uh, you get uh, 10 essential oils plus a diffuser so the first oil um, probably my most favorite oil is uh, lavender so lavender, you can, is what I reach for for pretty much anything. Um, you'll notice it smells different than other lavender that you've smelt. It's true lavender. Most of what there is actually a different, um, different species that is cheaper to produce called lavender. So it doesn't have the same therapeutic qualities. So this is what um, you are going to pop in your diffuser when you. Um, when you get your kit at night time, I put it on every night. I love it. Um, and uh, let's see, it helps with sleep. Um, and you can apply it to your nose, your pillow. Um, uh, it works wonderfully. And then there's peppermint. Peppermint's time to uh, awaken the senses. Um, it's very energizing. I diffuse it when I need to be focused and alert. Um, and it's also great for digestion. And then we have lemon, uh, cold press from the rind, wonderful and yummy in your water. Also great at uh, getting rid of any sticky stuff um, 
that you have on things like, you know, it works like a goo gone. Um, and I literally have the, the lemon in my water um, every day. I'm a little bit addicted to it. I love it. <laughs> Very refreshing. And um, uh, I'm not sure who's next. Anneli? Yes, that's okay. me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the next one, it's in the kit. And I just wanted to um, just mention something. It's 11 oils that come in the kit, um, not 10. So bonus one. Yippee. <laughs> <laughs> so um, the next one is Aroma Ease. Now, Aroma Ease is amazing for all things nausea. I'm talking morning sickness or chemo treatments or motion sickness. It just, it is all things nausea. I've literally used it where I got up to run to the bathroom because I was going to vomit and I instead opened the bottle and smelt it and I was totally fine. Um, so absolutely amazing for all things nausea. Um, then Thieves. Oh, Thieves. Oh, beautiful, wonderful Thieves. Actually, I should show you that this is what the kit looks like, by the way, since I have it next to me. Um, and it's, uh, this is, uh, I'm losing things, but there you go. There's all the pretty oils. There's another layer underneath, but I'll just show you that for now. Um, so Thieves is amazing. It is for all things immunity. Um, it comes from the legend of a bunch of thieves who were, um, robbing people during the bubonic plague and they were somehow surviving and not getting sick despite the fact that they were around these horribly ill slash dead humans. And so the king decided to be lenient on their punishment if they would reveal their secrets of their health. and. Along came thieves. Legend has it. So it's. I think it smells amazing. I think it smells like Christmas in a bottle. But this is amazing for all things immunity. So a lot of people will just like rub it on their hands and rub it on their kids' hair before they run out the door to go to school or for play dates or whatever. Um, but uh, they also have an entire range, um, as I men mentioned earlier, of thieves products like the cleaner. Um, They've got toothpaste, or a whole bunch of stuff that contains the Thieves blend because it's just so powerful and it's so amazing. And their hand sanitizer is glorious. It is amazing. It doesn't have that like alcohol smell and it doesn't leave your hands all dry. It's actually really moisturizing and oh, it's so nice. <laughs> Mine's arriving next week. I'm so excited. <laughs> so yeah, Thieves can be used for everything. Cleaning fruit, cleaning your counters, whatever all things amazing. Um, I know some, like uh, I think Haley had a sore throat a few weeks ago and put thieves straight in her mouth. Um, I, we've done it where we've rubbed it on our throats as well. Um, just amazing. Really, like it's really helpful. Um, the next one is Digize. Um, my daughter sometimes will jokingly say, oh, I think I must have uh, eaten something I shouldn't have because now I think I need Digize because my tummy's sore. She's totally like joking because I knew what she ate, but she just loves Digize so much, which is so weird because not everyone enjoys it, but if you don't like the smell or taste of it, you can put it under your feet, as we mentioned before. But this is for all things digestion. It's really amazing. So if the peppermint wasn't enough for you, um, go to Digize. You can um, put it on your esophagus. You can put it um, right over your stomach. Um, you can consume it. It helps with um, if you've had a big meal and you're feeling a bit bloated or if you... Um, are a bit intolerant of an ingredient, but you've eaten it anyway, and now you're cramping or gassy or whatever, Digize is your best friend for this kind of thing. Um, so yeah, it's really good. And then purification. <gasps> okay, I love the smell of this stuff. I put it on the one day and I left for an hour and I came back and as I walked into my house, I was like, wow, it's so fresh and so clean and so amazing. It was so good so so good some people put this on their animals as well so they don't have you know stinky wet dog smell um it is for all things stink um i've actually made a little bottle 
a spray bottle of um, the purification and peppermint and lemon together. And it is so glorious. Not that it needs the other two, but just why not? It's all like a bunch of my favorite in one spray bottle. Um, so it's really, really nice. It's, um, you can spray it in shoes. You can spray it in your car, in your gym bags. In fact, today I did laundry and I put purification in the, the tub, like where you put the, the laundry detergents. I put um, purification in there just because I was washing my CrossFit clothes and we all know. Um, so yeah, so that's, um, that's a lovely purification, all things stinky. And it also draws out stuff that's not supposed to be there. So like if you've got like a bite or a pimple, we don't get those though, right? Um, (laughs) okay. Yeah, we all do. Um, you can literally just put it straight on or dilute it if you, if you need to. Um, but it's, yeah, it's great. It draws, it draws it out. I tried this on someone before and it was like, amazing. amazing. But yeah, so that's those ones. Uh, Becca, do you want to yeah. take it away from Panaway? Cool. Yeah, I'll talk about some Panaway. I just used it uh, last night and this morning. So Panaway, awesome. it basically sounds like pain away. So Panaway, it's for sore, mu- sore muscles from working out or sitting at a computer all day. It's pricey, so I mix it up with some coconut oil and copaiba. I make it into a cream, and I just store it in a jar, or I do it in a roller. So just a few drops goes a really long way, and the coconut oil helps to spread it all over my legs, shoulders, backs, and back in anywhere that um, is having pain. So I feel immediate relief. It's pretty much like a uh, organic good form of Icy Hot, but way better. The next one is RC. It's the most amazing oil to use as a vapor test rub. Honestly, even in the diffuser or rubbed on the sinuses, this one always surprises me with how effective it is. So RC is really, really amazing to um, just kind of help us breathe. There is also a bonus oil and it is deep relief. And this is a phenomenal uh, oil as well. It is a blend that you must uh, pop a roller top you got to put a roller on the top of it and that comes in your kit and apply it to all of your sore muscles. You will feel those muscles melt and relax as soon as you put it on. It's great for post-workout too. Um, After long car rides, long trips, my lower back really hurts a lot. So I put that on and it goes away. The next thing we're going to talk about is Ninja Red. This is part of your starter kit and you also get a couple of samples of the Ninja Red drink. It is like basically a super drink and it's really, really delicious. My kids love it and so do I. So I love that they like the taste of it because it's healthy. I'm like, sure, go to town. So this is Young Living's Super Fruit Supplement and it's made from wolf berries from the Ninja province of France. It's supercharged with our... Sina. Oh, sorry. Sina. Uh, sorry, guys. My husband's calling me and I don't know how to get back to you. <laughs> Are you here? Yeah. Okay. Sorry about that. Didn't haven't had that happen before. So, um, what did I say? Were you saying China? It, yeah, you you said uh, the Ningxia region of France, and I was saying it's China. I said France. Yeah. That's well. Hilarious. I mean, lavender. You know, whatever. Cool. I don't know okay. why I said France. That's like, <laughs> where did that come from? My, that's how my brain works. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, not China, France. <laughs> and it's supercharged with our uh, a citrus essential oils. So just one ounce, like just one shot of Ninja Red will supply our body with vital antioxidants that provide a natural energy source. So uh, instead of my husband being addicted to his like Red Bulls, I'm like, what? Monster drinks? No, guys. What are you thinking? He's doing Ninja Red now. So anyway, he likes it. At first he didn't like want to switch, but I'm like, you're not doing these drinks anymore, dude. So um, this drink was developed after Gary, the Gary Young started our company, traveled to the Ninja province of China in his search for (laughs) cultures with vitality and longevity. So he found it in the Ninja Wolfberry. All Ninja red samples are in two ounce sizes, which make them really easy and convenient and ready to to travel. You can chill them, shake them, and drink them. And I actually don't even chill mine. Um, They're fine. Like, I don't know if we're supposed to, but I don't. So anyway, so your kit also comes with some 
sample bottles and a, and a roll on, which is like just a little filament that you put on top of the bottle to roll it on your body. You can pop it on any of our bottles and then all of them can be reused. So basically I just realized like when I, when some of my essential oil bottles are done, I will then refill them with the next order with part carrier oil and part oil, put a roll on on top. And then they're kind of like my travel, my travel oils. So nothing ever goes to waste. Um, so yep, save your empty bottles and make custom lens, which we will share with you in all of our support groups. You get access to our support groups when you get your kit. So um, along with the kit and the company, you get an amazing support team and us that just will help you learn everything you need to know. We share so much information and the groups have been around for so long that you can search for any information that you need. So when you buy the oils online or at a health food store, who shows you how to use them? Nobody. And with us, you get, you get us, you get tons of invaluable uh, knowledge and experience. So in closing, out of curiosity, how many of you said to yourself, wow, I could really use that one to at least one of the oils that we all just covered? And how many said that you could use two or three or more of them? So can you see why these are the best, the kits are like the best way to get started? Once you're comfortable with these oils, sorry, I'm in my car and people are like, what is she doing? So once you're comfortable <laughs> with these oils, you'll be ready to use pretty much any of them. They can be used to enhance your fitness programs, to keep you healthy, to deal with emotional baggage, and to support your hormones. So those are just a few of the things among millions that they can do for us. So there are three ways that you can order these amazing products, and you can save a ton of money in the process. It's kind of a good, better, best scenario. So the good way is to snag a premium starter kit at wholesale prices. You'll get all the oils you need to start supporting your body naturally, plus the diffuser. You'll also get the 24% off of wholesale membership. So you'll always get a discount on Young Living products. The better way is to get a premium starter kit, which we just went over, on essential rewards, and then add on two pack of Ninja Red and Thieves Household Cleaner. That's going to really kick off your wellness journey and get you moving forward fast. Your body will get the extra support it needs, and you'll be able to remove all sorts of toxic cleaners with the Thieves Household Cleaner. Plus, you'll automatically earn 10% back on your order when you get the free ER oil of the month. I love those free oils. Um, mm. So when you're on our essential rewards program, it basically means that you're part of our frequent buyers club. And that means tons and tons of perks. You'll get rewards back. So 10 to 25%, a free bottle of oil. Um, and you'll be set to start swapping out products over time in the most cost effective way. So if I like won the lottery, I would in one swipe, just swap everything out of my house that I currently use with Young Living, but I haven't won the lottery yet. So I'm just doing it like kind of slowly over time, even though it's not as slowly <laughs> as it could be, because I'm finding myself <laughs> ordering like three times a month. Um, <laughs> but anyway, that's totally personal preference, whatever you can do. So we call it transfer buying, and I can help you put together a plan. Any of us can help put together a plan for you. So the best way, so we've gone over the good, we've gone over the better. Now the best way is to get paid to play with your oils. So snag a premium starter kit on ER, Central Rewards that I just mentioned, and then share this with your friends and help them get started too. So when you love your oils and cleaner, just tell someone about it and you get paid. So we'll also show you how to do this. Um, a lot of people are like, I don't want to, I don't want to be salesy. I don't want to sell. And I'm like, well, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I don't consider myself salesy and selling. I'm basically just sharing products with my family and friends that I have found beneficial to me. It's kind of like uh, the other day, one of our grocery stores, they had dates on sale for 99 cents instead of $4. So I told everybody about that because that's a pretty phenomenal deal. And I like to share deals and share things that I love with my friends. So, I mean, that's what, I consider myself doing when I'm sharing my young living with people that I care about, just sharing products that we love and it benefits them 100% in the long run. And we just get paid to do that. So it's pretty awesome. So the starter kit is 160 with the dew drop diffuser and that runs for 10 hours and it has continuous inter or in a minute intermittent, sorry, <laughs> um, settings. There's different diffusers that you can choose. 
and they're all beautiful and wonderful. Mm -hmm. So we can get you signed up with the good, better, or the best option right now and get it delivered to you. So basically just talk to whoever invited you to this Zoom and whoever has shared Young Living with you, and we will help you get started. Um, if you have questions, don't be scared to reach out to us and ask us anything. So thanks for joining, y'all. This has been fun. We can't wait to help you convert your household from toxins and chemicals to toxin and chemical free. Yeah. <laughs>